Hey there, matchmakers. Welcome back to our next training video. So this is the step two, grow your network on Cupid. So you might be asking, what do you mean by network? So on Cupid, we as matchmakers utilize a shared database of singles. So as you can see here, I am a matchmaker. Um, you can see because it's little 29, I'll explain to this what this means a little later. But if you click down here on this little search, you can see all of our different singles on the database. Now, as we said, we are a brand new company. So obviously we're going to have a limited number of singles for the moment, but that's okay because we have more than 100 matchmakers on our platform. They are all working together to connect people and to bring more singles to the, to the Cupid database. But that's all about building your network. So how do you do that? How do you invite more singles to Cupid and kind of build your clout and your status as a matchmaker with a larger network and then obviously get rewarded by Cupid for helping us grow? There's two ways to reach your invite link. So option number one is right here in your dashboard. You'll see this little 29 and a little, uh, a little mail icon. The question is, why does that exist? So this little 29 is meant to signify the quantity of invites you are expected to do on a monthly basis to become an active matchmaker. You will see and you'll hear me talk a lot during training about active matchmaker status. So if you go down, you can actually see the leaderboard of all different folks. And there's me, myself how many invites I've actually done. And what I mean by invite is it's not just sending your link to someone, which we can see here, we can copy this link and this is my unique trackable link. It's not just that, someone has to actually come into Cupid and create a full profile and reach the dashboard before they are counted. So um, as you can see, we have lots of matchmakers all over the place starting to get active. The bigger and the more often this happens on a monthly basis and the more people that are added to Cupid, the better. So. You know, whenever you invite singles, I invite singles, I get clients, you get clients, we're all going to work from one central database, which is a better experience for everyone. Think about it. It's better for you as a matchmaker when you just start and there's an enormous database of accessible you know, singles to you. It's better for your clients because there's more options for them to meet and the platform of Cupid becomes more useful. And then finally, it's better for singles. They have more opportunities to be connected with different matchmakers because the database has become so large. So best way to use this is to copy it and you would put this somewhere else. So for example, you might use the texting function to send it to a whole bunch of your friends. You might use one of these links at the bottom that may or may not work based on the current iOS version. So probably the most reliable way is to copy this. You can add it to your Instagram on a link tree. You can add it to your TikTok. Add it to places where people come and find you. And as you create content and as you drive more interest to your business, you want people to sign up for Cupid using your link. If they don't sign up for Cupid using your link, it's not a trackable action and we can't reward you for it. Some of the ways we reward you is on the dashboard of singles and for matchmakers in the future, you will see on the dashboard this list of active matchmakers, which basically means whenever a new person signed up for Cupid, on the dashboard, you'll see all these different tiles that say the most active matchmaker. That list is built from this invite system, this leaderboard right here. So we are constantly developing new ways to reward you, our matchmakers, for driving more singles to the platform. This is a core part of your job, as your job is to search, screen, and select potential matches for your client. Probably the number one piece is making sure you have a nice network of people you've connected with, you know who they are, you know what they're looking for. Whether they're a single or a client, the more people that you know, the better you get at this, the better you're like, oh, I know. Jack would go really well with Teresa, and Mary would go really well with Jackie. You know, so um, that's it for the invite. So this is how to grow your network is to copy this link, share it on social media, share it with your community, and then um, text it to people and invite them to join Cupid. And then you get rewarded for that action. Thank you very much. And I'll see you on the next training.